guys, how's it going? Today I wanted to talk about a couple of things that uh, some of you have asked me about having a family on a boat. One major thing is health insurance. Um, it doesn't do you any good to have um, American health insurance if you're not in America. So we did a lot of research and I, I found an amazing guy who is uh, a great insurance agent. I'll put his information up on the screen so you can contact him. Um, but he set us up with Cigna uh, Cigna Global. There's lots of different options and different packages you can choose from, but we chose one with a really low premium. Um, and when I say low premium, I mean like between $200 and $250 a month for all of us. And um, But our deductible is really high. We have a $10,000 deductible and that's for inpatient care only. So for instance, Anna had her tonsils out just a few months ago uh, in the States so we had to pay out of pocket seven thousand dollars because it was outpatient services so the insurance didn't cover any of that another example was last year in panama we only had u.s health care and kate had fallen out of a tree and broke her wrist she had to get x-rays and anesthesia she was in the hospital and everything and we had to pay cash for that um our u.s policy wouldn't cover it but it was only about uh, two thousand dollars so so it was better off to just pay cash and not even mess with having a U.S. policy. But compared to what we were paying before, regular Obamacare American insurance, uh, we're saving a ton of money. Um, now, for me, I have a pre-existing condition. I had bladder cancer uh, for five years, from 05 to 2010. So I've been in remission for eight years now. However, this particular plan chose not to cover me for that particular um, condition. So they cover all of us. They cover me for anything else except if I were to have bladder cancer. So we stuck with an, um, an American plan just for the cancer until this Obamacare thing uh, is up for renewal in November. We can look at different plans, I think, in November and reevaluate everything as far as that's concerned. So I'll, I'll send you the information for our guy. His name is Arno Chris Peels. He's, um, he's sells insurance, but he does several different things. He's not one of those uh, crummy agents who just wants to get your money. He knows what he's talking about. He knows what he's doing and he wants what's best for your family. So, so another thing that I wanted to mention also is um, renting a car in a foreign country. Um, a lot of them require an international driving permit, so they're really easy to get before you leave the States. Just go to your local AAA office. It's 20 bucks. Um, you take a passport photo and you get it done, and then you won't have any trouble um, like we have had getting, uh, getting rental cars. Last thing I want to mention, and I've already kind of exhausted the topic of homeschooling previously, but I did have a couple of people ask us what curriculum we're using now that we're on the boat we are very limited online and um, the curriculum that i love is called switched on schoolhouse sos it comes on cd roms so you don't have to have internet and you just install it onto uh, a pc it doesn't work with a mac and it's it's self grading for the most part 99 percent um, of the work is done by the kids graded by the computer so when you have multiple children it makes it a lot easier for for me as a teacher to, uh, to keep up with what they're doing and the grades that they're, they're making. So that's uh, just another thing that I wanted to share. <laughs> there you go, that's it. Later, folks. That's it, that's all I got. There you go, that's it, just end it there. That's, that's it, just end it there. Bye-bye. That's it.